Well, it was very exciting the day that we got this faxed later than FedEx letter from the National Endowment for the Humanities saying, congratulations, six of the quilts in your collection have been selected for inclusion in this national project. Uh, we were thrilled and it was made that much more special this past Tuesday when uh, we were at the White House and uh, the President and the First Lady made the formal announcement of the collection. And it's, it is really neat that you know six Lancaster County masterpieces, probably more from here than any other single geographic area in the country, uh, were selected for inclusion in this, this teaching tool. I mean, we're in pretty heady company. I mean, everything from the Brooklyn Bridge to the Lansdowne Portrait of George Washington, you name it. I mean, modern works, historic works, photography, ceramics, and then six Lancaster County quilts. They really are wonderfully iconic pieces. I think people will recognize these for sure. This is, in fact, one of the quilts that the U.S. Postal Service about 15, 20 years ago used as a stamp. Uh, so a lot of people have actually licked this quilt, at least figuratively, that is.